It is our final award, the Community Hero Award, and it's presented by ACON. So to present the award, please welcome back to the stage ACON CEO Nicholas Parkhill and former NRL player Casey Conway. It is ACON's absolute pleasure and honour to once again present uh, the Community Hero Award. Uh, and the Community Hero Award is really focused on honouring someone who has spent often many years working for our community, often behind the scenes, often across multiple organisations, to really advance uh, our rights, our health, uh, and, and various things that make us as a community stronger. Uh, we have some incredible finalists tonight. We had some amazing nominations. Um, once again, it was a very tough decision for the, for the judges, as I think you'd be able to tell from tonight's each category of awards. Um, so without talking any longer, I'll um, let us look at those finalists. Sue Thompson, for over 30 years of advocating for the safety of the LGBTIQ community in New South Wales. Sue was instrumental in building bridges between New South Wales Police and the LGBTI community by pioneering the Gay and Lesbian Liaison Officer program in the 1990s. Peter Friend, for being a strong advocate for the visibility, rights and welfare of transgender people. Peter is the co-founder of Trans Pride Australia, which provides support for transgender people and raises awareness of issues affecting the transgender community. Robin Kennedy, for her unwavering commitment to the LGBTIQ community spanning over four decades. Over the years, Robin has advocated for LGBTIQ rights through various roles with groups such as CAMP, Gay Solidarity, Gay Task Force and First Mardi Gras Inc. Shane Brown, for his passionate advocacy for LGBTIQ issues over many years, including his work with youth support organisation Weave, where he instigated a range of projects addressing issues such as Indigenous support, youth disengagement and inclusion in his local community of Redfern. Um, congratulations on, uh, to all the nominees um, and thank you. Um, thanks for the, the hard the work that you do, um, the tireless effort you put in uh, and the love that you have um, for our community. Um, you know, I guess um, you know, we're not able to measure the impact of the work that you have, um, so thank you um, for reaching all corners of our LGBT community. Um, our 2018 winner is Robin Kennedy. <laughs> Uh, first of all, I would like to congratulate my fellow nominees who I think have all made a tremendous contribution to our community. Uh, I began my uh, career as a community activist in 1975 at the tender age of 21 when I joined camp and quickly became a member of the executive committee and a um, political action group. And I guess I've continued to be involved working for our community in one way or another ever since. As I said to Robin Plaster in the foyer before we came in tonight, I can't seem to stop myself. Uh, <laughs> so I think any of us that have worked for our community, for our rights, for inclusion, for diversity. I don't think any of us see ourselves as community heroes, but I think we are all community heroes. Every time we stand up against homophobia, every time we correct someone who assumes our partner is of the opposite sex. And every time we proudly march or dance down Oxford Street in the parade, I think we're all community heroes. So I'd just like to thank uh, Akon very much for this award. Um, I'm quite overwhelmed by it. It's a tremendous honour. And I encourage you all to keep being community heroes. Thank you.